Point News Tracker is going to take you to the financial district in Providence where two people were stabbed overnight. As you can see, those stabbings happened just about a block away from each other. New tonight, we're learning more about the stabbings and the suspect in custody. Eyewitness News reporter Kim Kalunian is live in our studio now with more. Kim. Well, Caroline and Steve, police are still trying to determine if these stabbings are connected. Tonight, one man is in custody. Two early morning stabbings in Providence leave two men in their 20s hurt. The first here at Hanley's on the corner of Peck and Pine. There was a uh, gentleman on the dance floor. He felt some pressure uh, in his buttocks area. He went into the men's room to check and it looked like uh, to him um, he had a, uh, a wound of probably about three inches long. Shortly after, police say another man was slashed on his back at the corner of Orange Street nearby. Police say this man, 24-year-old Yokendri Carmona, matched the description of the suspect and was seen running down Friendship Street. We were there as he was arrested. He's now charged with slashing the second man. We are also looking into him to see if he is the assailant at Hanley's. Providence Police Major David LaPayton says they're currently running tests on a knife and will be looking at surveillance video to see if Carmona is connected to the other stabbing. Both victims are expected to be okay. <laughs> LaPayton says this type of activity in the downtown area is unusual despite the weekend crowds. So we've been fortunate that we haven't had many incidents um, such as this one or things like this in the, in the past. And Major LaPayton tells me this issue will be brought to the Board of Licenses. Whether or not they will hold a hearing and take action is unclear. Live in studio, I'm Kim Kalunian, Eyewitness News. Thanks, Kim.